Howdy. My name is Herb and welcome to my workshop. Today I want to show uh, a little bit of progress on my uh, 15cc engine. If you've been following my series, uh, I've been working on this for about six, eight months now. I uh, wanted to show how I did the uh, mixing adjustment pins or needles and uh, uh, so that's the that's the subject today I've got a ruler here just to show you the the size uh, of these uh, these needles uh, first of all uh, I uh, took some 3 8 inch uh, brass rod and uh, knurled it and I sliced off these little uh, little uh, knob handles and it's uh, of course it was drilled then I hand tapped them to uh, uh, 256 which is uh, smallest I've ever done anything but uh, that's how I did the uh, the knob portion. The actual needle is built from a uh, one inch long uh, 256 cap head uh, screw. What I did is I, I did a uh, a jig. This is not the right one but uh, you thread it in there then on the grinder I usually go from the other side and I'll grind that off flat then unscrew the screw out so this is the the uh, ER32 uh, collet this is a 1 16th uh, collet which is the smallest I had but a 256 screw will tighten up in there. It uh, it uh, takes a little while to get it tight, but it will tighten up. And you just leave a little bit exposed, then your uh, compound comes in and uh, cuts it off. And then you just add a, a couple of foul each cut. Uh, with the uh, cross slide and go back and forth with the uh, the compound add in a little couple more thou and go in until you get a needle point and uh, as I said before this fits in uh, and fill inside this fits in the uh, the six jaw chuck on my lathe and of course that will go in there like that. But you put it in there and set your uh, compound to uh, uh, 20 degrees or whatever the angle you're going to take and very carefully and on the high speed the lathe will go uh, turn it down to uh, where you've got a, a needle point. So that's that's how those are done. And those fit in various places on the carburetor but that's the uh, that's the adjustment uh, and there's a spring I don't have any springs here but there's a spring that fits in over the rod and, and uh, is captured by the knob and the carburetor body and that keeps tension on the uh, on the adjustment, so as uh, it didn't change with vibration. But uh, so that's the uh, that's the adjustment screws for the carburetor, and uh, we'll uh, mark off one more step. Thanks for watching. 